Anthony, just to start off, just what was it like to be back in a game setting after all this time? Well, it feels good. You know, I was able to go through my routine today, you know, put my pads on, uh, get a few snaps out there. You know, everything felt good. Well, how much were you looking forward to it before? I mean, it's preseason, so not the same, but were you anxious to get out there? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. You know, uh, throughout this whole process, you know, I've been anxious to do a lot of things, you know, just practice, you know, put my helmet back on. So it's just taking it step by step, day by day. And, you know, today we had a game and, you know, it just felt good just being out there again. Yeah, so like, right before the game, around warm ups, like you went out, had the full uniform on and kind of pointed to the sky. Was that like you just praying or what were you doing in those moments to kind of just center yourself? No, nah, that's just, that's something I do, you know. Uh, Every chance I get the opportunity to step on the field, you know, that's just me just thanking God for the opportunity again, you know, because, you know, everybody don't get this opportunity to be on the field. Everybody, you know, don't get the chance to be in the NFL. So, you know, I just got to make sure I'm appreciating and taking it day by day. What are you looking to accomplish just over these two series, and do you feel like you, you hit that today? I uh, was just trying to manage the game, you know, just take what the defense gave me. Uh, I feel like it was a few players we left out there, but, you know, it's all good. We're still, you know, working on the chemistry and stuff and just building it as an offense. Is it a little bit different? Is it a little bit different when you're, you're you know, the last time you were playing, you're in the regular seasons, so you're game planning. This is a little bit more like you guys are just running normal stuff. Um, I can say it's a little different, but not not too much different because at the end of the day, you still got to execute the play, you know, regardless of what coach calls out there. You know, um, but I feel like, you know, it was good out there, but, you know, sometimes you just want to do a little better. Much decision on going out of bounds. So, was there much decision on that? I mean, did you think about cutting up and see what can I get out of this play, or is that what you nah, need? Oh, man. To do? Nah, I, mean, I mean, it's nothing to really do right there. You know, just protect yourself. Uh, even if this was last year, you know, that's the same thing. You know, take care of yourself. You know, uh, get what you can get. And if you can make a play, make a play. If not, don't try to force it. It's another small sample size, but you and Jonathan got to connect again today. What, what was that like? Uh, it was fun. Uh, it felt like practice a little bit, you know, just, just handing the ball off, letting them work. Um, you know, it feels good just making plays, but hopefully we get those home run hits that we're looking for. Looking ahead to Arizona coming in, what do you hope to accomplish in those two joint practices this week? Execute, you know, execute the plan, whatever uh, Coach Shane puts together, you know, be able to manage whatever uh, their defense throws at us. You know, and just just execute. You know, that's the main thing we're looking forward to because we know we got to play them uh, this upcoming Saturday. So just execute and just be prepared. And this uh, road back from the injury, you know, you, you talked about the first day you threw, and then obviously getting back to the OTAs and all that. I mean, where is, is this a big step in that process, like that first preseason game? Oh yeah, for sure. You know, just being able to put my uniform back on and being able to go back out there in front of the fans and all the supporters. You know, it's a blessing because uh, I know I definitely missed it last year a lot, just running out there and just being back on the field. So uh, this is another, you know, step in the journey, and hopefully I get to take some more. That first first down with, with Mo, like, what did that feel like? Did you feel like, okay, now I'm, like, in a groove a little bit? Or? Oh, uh, yeah. You know, uh, the first first series, first drive, you know, they brought a little pressure. Um, try to get it out quick, you know, just, just play hot or whatever. But the second drive, I was able to get a completion, you know, get Mo going. So it's like, okay. You know, it feels good now. Hopefully, let's just keep it going. It's kind of funny, you were doing your sideline interview, and then Micah gets, gets the takeaway. Do, do you enjoy seeing other guys do things like that, guys fighting for roster spots? Man, I just enjoy just seeing people ball out, you know, regardless of who it is, you know, if, if they got a spot on the team or not, or if they're working for it, you know, just seeing people ball out, you know, it's always good because, you know, whenever I'm out there, I hope people enjoy watching me ball out. So, you know, just seeing guys just do their thing, you know, it's a blessing. With Josh going down for a little bit, how important is it for you and Anthony Gould and you and AD to kind of get those extra reps behind the scenes? Um, you know, it was, it's just as important as if Josh was still here, you know. Not like he died or anything, but, uh, <laughs> but you know, regardless of what the situation is, you know, you always got to have that next man up mentality because uh, you never know, like, when your, your opportunity is going to show up, when, it, when your opportunity is there. So you just got to take advantage of it. Hopefully, I know, I know they're going to be ready. So, you know, it's not, not too much pressure. What has, AD, a couple more? what has AD shown you throughout the preseason so far? Man, he's a, he's a dog, you know. Uh, if you give him the ball, you know, he's going to make a play. You know, if you throw it up for him, he's going to make a play. You know, so you know, I'm, just, I'm glad we got a weapon like that on our team. You know, I'm just looking forward to more. Josh, since injury, not that he died, but how is he, how is <laughs> he handling this? Nah, he's good. You know, uh, just like anything, everybody's, you know, was a little disappointed because, like, 
thing, man. We were looking forward to being back out there on the field together. But, you know, the time going to come. Everything happened for a reason. But my boy, he all good. You, you have, it seems like, started to have, like, real connections with your guys individually, the receivers. That, that takes time. I mean, have, has that grown a lot in training camp? It seems like it has. Man, it's, it's grown a lot uh, just in general, you know. Um, in football, you know, you can have relationships on the field. You know, guys can trust you on the field. But it's got to be the same thing off the field, you know, just com- com- conversating with guys or just linking up with them, you know, certain times throughout the day. You know, just, just building that connection, knowing them deeper than football. So I feel like the connections with, with the guys have definitely, you know, gained. So, um, you know, hopefully we just keep it going and you know, build more chemistry.